researchers shed new light on harbor technologies of ancient Rome. Portus, the maritime harbor of Rome at the height of the Roman Empire, was a port complex composed of basins and canals connecting the commercial harbor to the city via the Tiber River. Now, an international team of archaeologists and geologists has applied marine geology techniques at the archaeological site to uncover harbor technologies of the 1st century CE. Portus was established in the middle of the 1st century CE and for well over 400 years was Rome's gateway to the Mediterranean. It was centered around a large hexagonal basin, which can still be found today near Rome's Fiumicino Airport. The port play a key role in funneling imports to the citizens of Rome from across the region and beyond. Dating ancient harbor sediments is a major challenge, given ports are not only subjected to weather events throughout history, but the lasting effects of human activity, said Dr. Agadlis Pronovost, an archaeology research fellow and a marine geologist at La Trobe University. In order to overcome the problems of dating harbor deposits, Dr. Lies Pronovost and colleagues used a range of high-resolution sediment analyzers including piston coring, X-ray scanning, radiocarbon dating. These methods allowed precise identification of major reworked events, including dredged and hyperpeak mill deposits. Ancient harbors can accumulate sediments more rapidly than natural environments, which is the case of Portus built in the River Delta and where sediment accumulated at a rate of about 1 meter per century, Dr. Lies Pronovos said. Applying these methods allowed us to date and precisely reconstruct the sequence of events of the historical port, including dredging to maintain enough draft and canal gate use. The findings suggest that the Romans were proactively managing their river systems from earlier than previously thought, as early as the 2nd century CE. The team's paper was published in the March 2019 issue of the journal Quaternary International, 